Hi Stargazers, this is Marcy of Earth Sky. Here's your moon phases and visible planets for August 2025. It's a great month for planets. We've got a spectacular conjunction and a planet parade. The first quarter moon falls on August 1st. First quarter moons rise around noon and set at midnight. Look for it high overhead as darkness falls. And the moon is farthest from Earth that day as well. The full sturgeon moon lights up the sky all night overnight on August 8th through 9. It's named the sturgeon moon because of the abundance of sturgeon fish easily caught in lakes and rivers this time of year. The moon's closest point to the earth for this month is on August 14th. The last quarter moon is on August 16th. Last quarter moons rise around midnight and set at noon. Can you spot it high in the sky after sunrise? We'll have the darkest skies for stargazing on the nights around the new moon on August 23rd. As for planets, you can see three planets in the morning sky the first two days of August. You'll find brilliant Venus and bright Jupiter getting closer together each day before dawn and Saturn shines in the southern sky. Venus and Jupiter will have their closest conjunction on the morning of August 12th. Spectacular! And while you're enjoying the Venus and Jupiter conjunction, the sky will be sprinkled with some Perseid meteors. The bright gibbous moon will wash out all but the brightest Perseids that morning, but you might see some of them. Then in mid-month, Mercury joins the visible morning planets, but you'll need to spot Saturn before dawn, and Mercury will be only visible in morning twilight. In fact, there's actually six planets in the morning sky, however, you won't be able to see them all at once. Why can't you see all six planets simultaneously? Mercury is only visible during the morning twilight, while Saturn will disappear before dawn. Venus and Jupiter are visible before dawn and during the morning twilight. However, Uranus and Neptune require optical aid to be observed. Meanwhile, Mars is the sole planet visible in the evening sky and shines near the star Spica. The moon visits Saturn on August 11 and 12. The moon visits Venus and Jupiter on August 19 and 20. They'll lie among the bright stars Procyon, Pollux, and Castor. And the moon joins Mercury on August 21st. Venus and Jupiter are nearby. After moving to the evening sky, the moon pairs up with Mars and Spica on August 25th and 26th. I hope you enjoy stargazing as much as I do. Please like, subscribe, and share so you don't miss any upcoming night sky events.